Kids, would you look at this? Wow, now this is a superhero base. Holy smokes, they got a training room and computers and lights. Well, this piece of crap out of Coons Base, huh, new kid? Gee, I can play here every day. What are you doing here? Oh, hey, uh, hey, Mysterion. Well, we were just hoping to speak with Dr. Timothy. Why? Uh, the new kid wants to switch franchises and I told him I'd help. Hey, new kid, thought you might end up here. They're here to spy on what Timothy is working on. I see we rip them to shreds. Calm down, everyone. Let's hear what they have to say. Oh, God. It's him. This is a fairly shocking change of heart for you, Professor. You really wish to help the new kids switch franchises? Well, yeah. You, you, you know, we just thought that, you, you know, your franchise seems a lot more open and progressive. And, uh, uh, you know, we just thought he should switch because Coon and Friends kind of isn't going anywhere. Oh, God, see, the new kid came to me and said, uh, how do I quit Coon and Friends? And since I hate Coon and Friends, I decided to help him out. You get anything? The aluminum foil on his helmet seems to be blocking my abilities. Don't trust them, Doc. They can't see what you've been working on back there. What if the new kid really wants to switch? We can see if the new kid's intentions are pure. We're sending Tupperware on a very important mission today. You can help him with that mission. I don't need backup, especially not a noob. Easy, Tup. Remember the Freedom Pals motto. Yeah, retribution, but with inclusion. I'll send you the details on the mission. When you get there, we can begin. In the meantime, I must get back to my work. Greeting, fellow Coon and uh, Freedom Pal? Here's Bite Lord now. Great job, hero. Those Freedom Posers have no idea you fucked them over. All right, guys, listen up. Bite Lord has discovered that the Freedom Pals are infiltrating the police station tonight. We have to get there before they do. The police station? We can't take down the police, are you crazy? Yeah, just let the Freedom Pals go do it. We can't do that, guys. Why not? Because at approximately 10.30 a.m. this morning, Classy was arrested by the police. How do you know? Yo, what the fuck? You came where the bitches said you protect my ass. They only give me one motherfucking phone call, so y'all niggas better come and get me the fuck out of here, lame-ass superhero wannabe motherfuckers. We have to help her, fellas. We made a promise. If we let Freedom Pals go do this on their own, then we're the douchebag franchise they say we are. But why would Freedom Pals work with us? Don't forget the new kid is all buddy-buddy with Freedom Pals now. Butt Lord can trick them into an assault on the lower level of the police station, and meanwhile we'll sneak in and bust Classy out. We're probably gonna get the Freedom Pals killed. And then whose superhero franchise would be number one? We did make a promise to Classy. Everyone get home and get to bed. We have a big job to do tonight. That'll be all, Butt Lord. Go home and wait to hear from the Freedom Pass. It's about time. You know how hard it is to look mysterious when you're just standing around in some kid's front yard? It's pretty fucking hard. I'm glad you're with us, new kid. It's been tough being the only one on the team with real superpowers. While all the other kids are playing and working on their franchise plans, I'm stuck defending the city against evil, with barely any time to work on my pitch for a Mysterion spin-off movie. Sometimes it feels like a curse having these powers. You know how it is, because you're like me. I'm sure the power of your ass weighs heavy on you. There is no way, no way, that kid is sneaking out tonight. Well, you better hope not. It's fucking crazy out here. Don't like to talk about it, huh? That's okay, I understand. Tina. Let's just get to the police station and find the evidence we need. Tina, where'd you go? Tina! No, Mom. No, please Tina, don't. I'm sorry. I'll be a good boy, I promise. Please. Please don't drown me. You can't drown what you can't catch! Wow, the adults in this town are really out of their fucking minds. Hey, crime fighter! What's your living situation? We should chase Hope you like eggs! What a bunch of dicks! It's worse than I thought, you kid. This is not normal. You're really mysterious, new kid. And coming from Mysterion, that's really high praise. Look, there they are! All right, Freedom Pals, here's the plan. Once we get inside the police station, Tool Shed and the new kid will set up a diversion and then the... Wait a minute, what the fuck? Yeah, come on, guys, uh, we've got to get inside the police station. What are you assholes doing here? We're here to investigate a hot lead regarding the South Park Police. Ah, that's what we're doing! Oh, no, 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 this is our superhero mission, Freedom Pals. Fuck you guys. Get lost before there's a fight. Fellas, fellas, 
Have we all forgotten there's a little girl in trouble in there? Fast pass is right. I suppose that just this once we should put our petty differences aside and work together. All right, Mysterion, what's the plan? I think some of us should cause a diversion. Make the cops head towards it so the rest of us can sneak in without the cops noticing. Good idea. Coon friends will go up the fire escape and cause the diversion so Freedom Pals can sneak in the front. This is all pretty coincidental. Did you guys just steal our lead again? Innocent people are being arrested, Toolshed. That's all that matters to us. It should be all that matters to you. Okay, Coon friends up the fire escape. Come on, guys. Stand by. We gotta wait for the diversion. Come take a look at this. Oh, man, that's strong shit. Yeah, does this coke seem a little off to you? No, no, this is sweet. You guys want to call some hookers? What the fuck was that? Come on, let's check it out. Bring the coke. All right, come on, Butlord. The coast is clear. Chaos! I got your back, man. Ah, crap! Kick down the door, I guess. I can't believe I just said that. Oh shit, a criminal! And he's with an innocent child! Code red! Assault on the precinct! Wow, I didn't see that coming. That's enough! Just stand down, kid! Look, I know why you're here. You're fed up. Because you think all cops do is harass black people. I know that to a young kid it can seem like cops are racist and bigoted, but you can't believe what the media tells you. Cops are just people, like you, your friends, your family. People who work hard to- Spook! Oh! Uh, Tupperware! Damn it, Levinsky, get your ass upstairs, sir! And turn on the alarm! The fucking asshole shot at me! Get him! This isn't going to get any easier, but those cops need to pay. Hey, get us out of here! Token, thank God you're here, son. Dad! What the fuck are you doing here? They're trying to free the criminals! Get down! Get down! Okay, okay, I know this looks bad. You really think cops just go around arresting black people for no reason? What purpose could that possibly serve? It's reverse discrimination, that's what it is. If we were all black cops and our jails were filled with white people, nobody would say a word. So I guess you've learned that the real bigots here are you. Huh, kids? Guess you can all go home. No? Fuck. We're innocent, so breaking out of jail isn't a crime, right? I'm not sticking around to find out. I smell a class action lawsuit. Supreme Court, here we come. Token, what did I tell you about playing too rough? But Mom, I was defending justice. I don't care what you were defending. You could have gotten hurt. But Tupper can't get hurt. He's impervious to pain. Is he impervious to getting his butt spanked? No. That's right. Hey, kid, I was just messing around about the government. They're not so bad. They're actually pretty good guys. Be cool, man. They're listening to us right now. Just act natural. Oh, shit, they're probably tracking this call. I'm fucking out of here. Okay, new kid, we have to sneak past this guy to that door over there. Ah! You know what a cop is, new kid? A cop is a slave. A robot who's told not to think for himself. It's the politicians who are the real bigots. That mayor has been sitting in her office telling us we have to change our ways. The only way to have her removed was to raise crime in the streets. And now cops are finally able to do things the old way again. Don't you see this is better for everyone? Holy shit, that scramble! What? You found the missing cat, but Lord! Freedom Pals, we've got the police chief, top floor! What can I say, you kids have me by the balls. Almost by the balls. You know, not every prisoner we have here is black. We actually do have one white guy. 
This is a trap! I'm sorry, kids, but you left me no choice. You're still looking good. Eating the Subway sandwiches. His name is Jared, and he's still looking good. Hey, kids. You want some candy? Oh, fuck, it's Jared. You'll excuse me if I don't want to watch this. I just love conjugal visits. Ah. Whoa. What are the police doing with the people they arrested? Oh, how should I know? I'm just a sandwich guy. New kid, fart in his face. No, no, please, please, I'm sorry. I'll tell you anything. What is the police chief hiding? There's, there's more cells down below. Cops take that elevator. Prisoners go down there, but they don't come back. What's the code? Come on, how should I know, huh? Ah, ah, yeah, yeah, I seen him type it in. 1477. Please, I, I'm sorry. It's just that I like being with children, you know, because I because I never had a childhood of my own. Yeah, that's it. I like kids because I never had a childhood. It's your decision, new kid. Part of being a superhero is deciding what to do in moments like these. That was hardcore. All right, well, that was pretty uncomfortable. I know being a vector for disease is kind of my thing, but I, I feel kind of dirty. Should we do anything with the body? Yeah. Protect, serve, bang, bang. This is a one-time shot, Coon. After tonight, we are enemies again. Our petty little differences aren't what matter right now, Mysterion. Black lives matter. Yeah, dick. You're a fucking dick, Mosquito. Huh? What was that? Hello? Hello, is someone there? No, I guess no one's there. Or else they would have said something. All right, then. It's just me and you, kitty. No one's gonna find us in here. Come on. Give me that good stuff. Hey, stop it. Hold still! Oh, bananas. The cat got away. Can't see a thing in here. Sounds like the cat's getting into the toxic chemicals. Oh, darn it, that's not good. I hope those weren't the toxic chemicals I was just talking about that broke on the floor just now. Oh, no, I, I think they were. Drat. If those chemicals mix together on the floor, it'll turn into a gas that'll kill me in seconds. Blast it, there's the gas. Yes, <laughs> it's definitely killing me now. <laughs> oh, oh, well, thank God. The exhaust fan's sucking out the toxic gas. <sighs> yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna die. Now, where's that blasted cat? <laughs> oh no, I think the cat just jumped into the exhaust fan and jammed it. The gas is filling up the room and it's killing me again. I'm dying again. Sounds like the emergency door closed. Yep, the emergency door closed. I'm trapped in here. I need to get out of here. Just have to <coughs> feel around for the doorknob. Here, here it is. Yes, I'm saved. Oh, blast it. The door's locked. Now I'm stuck in here. Somebody help me. The gas is killing me. I'm really dying this time. Seriously, I can feel myself dying. It's so painful. Help for the, for the love of everything, if you're, if you're there and you can hear me right now, do something, it's it's killing me, it's killing me. Wait, I think I feel the light switch. With my last breath, I'll just turn it on.
that there's some dangerous shit behind that door. You should use the vending machine to stock up on supplies before you go in there. Yeah, yeah, Shab Nigarath. Black goat of the woods, blessed be us, your faithful servants, the destroyers of light. Yeah, yeah, Shab Nigarath. Black goat of 1,000 morbid young, draw down the moon and extinguish the sun. All right, let him go. No! Uh, sir? Huh? Oh, I see. I guess because cops feed African Americans to an elder god, they're racist. Shub Niggeroth is an outer god, kids, who must be appeased and whose coming was foretold by the great H.P. Lovecraft. But I suppose H.P. Lovecraft was a racist, too. Oh, fuck. Was he really? Like, like how racist? Really, really? Yo, it's my homeboy! Give me the fuck up out of here! These niggas completely crack! Let's end it! All right. You kids want a battle? Let's do this. This is messed up. We have to save them! Okay, chuck another one in. Aw, oh, fucking hell no! Ow! Oh, shit! No! The All-Mother can't stand white meat! Get out of tentacle range! The All-Mother demands black flesh! So? I'm not afraid! Kill the Unbeliever! Show no weakness! Freedom Pals, there's a certain intel we have that we can't share with you. You know, it's classified. That's because we've been tricked. Ah, oh, fuck. The new kid played us, Freedom Pals. Wanting to join our side was a ruse. What? Yeah, the new kid kind of totally fucked you guys over. Sorry. They followed our lead to the police station and now intend to get a hundred dollar reward for that missing cat. Well, all is fair in love and war, Freedom Pussies. <laughs> I love when you call them Freedom Pussies. You assholes! We're the ones that stopped the police chief's evil plan. We deserve that hundred dollar reward. Oh, yeah? Just try and take it from us. We will! Civil War III, it's going down! That's it, new kid. We're gonna rip you apart. No, Mysterion. We won't fight the new kid. They will. All right, new kid. Time to die. Let's get this little shit. Okay, but then why didn't my brain get hacked? Sorry, Chaos. Unfortunately, Dr. Timothy can only dominate so many minds at once. Ah, shake it off, Chaos!
You're gonna hate me for this. Oh, ha! You'll never browse in this town again. Come on! Punish the new kid! Don't worry, I got to cover you. I am unswattable! Dr. Timothy made a crucial mistake when he failed to control chaos. I wish I could like that twice. Sorry about your turn. Get that traitor. He got right. Yeah. Hello, oh, geez. I have a really good feeling about this, guys. Fucked by the long dong of justice. Freedom Pal or Coon Friend, you're cool in my book, new kid. Coon and friend. Hmm, maybe I'm leaning towards Freedom Pal. Cartman's oh. only working for himself, new kid. I'm about ready to detonate some social media accounts. Weird. That's not cool, Timothy. I'm back on Team Butthole now. Wow, nice shot! I'm ready to suck ass and take names. Wait, that didn't come out right. here or infect half of South Park. We could do better than half. All evil fears the lasers of kites. Give it to me. Dramatic coon move incoming. Yeah. Freedom pal down. Glad to be working with you, new kid. Yeah, super friends. minds today, Dr. Timothy. Now you're gonna pay. Fully functional? Seems a little slow.
Super Crank reporting for duty. Mega Fist Punch. Okay, here we go. Got something for ya. Did somebody call for Call Girl? Honing in on the signal. Hey, somebody already used your visa to buy six pallets of Levitra. Give him hell, douchebag. Yeah, I saw that coming. Whoa, what the... What happened? How'd my lip get busted? Where the fuck did Classy go? Dr. Timothy! You fucking animal! He was trying to help us! Dude, Mysterion is pissed at you, new kid. You guys started this war, not us! You don't fucking understand! Dr. Timothy was working on a way to save all of us! Freedom pals and coon friends! What? <laughs> Easy, Doc. You've taken a lot of hits. Wow, this is your guys' base? This is fantastic! This looks like so much fun! Yeah, I mean, Coon Lair has a lot of cool stuff too. But yeah, this is cool. Dr. Timothy was never your enemy. He was trying to help us all. But how? With this. Oh my god. He's figured it out. It was Dr. Timothy's passion. He worked tirelessly on it. A franchise plan that involved everyone. Each hero got their own movie and TV series. Every hero mathematically equal to the other. Jesus. This is... Incredible. Timothy almost worked himself to death trying to come up with it. <laughs> so while we were out trying to stick it to you guys, Timmy was actually trying to include us. Yeah, and then this kid nearly killed him. We're sorry the new kid is an asshole. That isn't our fault. Yeah, we were just using you guys. There's a hundred dollar reward for this cat. And you wanted her to yourselves. Yeah, but not anymore. If we proved anything tonight, it's that we are the best when we are all together. It's too late for that. We all started as one team. We all wanted to be superheroes for the same reason. To sell our franchise and make millions of dollars. Let's be one team again. I agree. Come on, guys. No more civil war. Let's get the reward money for this cat and use it together for one franchise. Yeah, let's do it. All right. But we're calling it Freedom Pals? Freedom Pals. And so, like, Timmy is sort of the leader of Freedom Pals? He's like the, he's like the one in charge? Yes. Well, I think it's awesome. Honestly, Freedom Pals is a way better name than Coon and Friends. Freedom Pass. Freedom Pass. I'm super cool with this. Then it's settled. Tomorrow, we get the reward money for Scrambles, and we use it to kickstart Timmy's franchise plan. Together. Freedom Pals. Retribution. But, but with, with inclusion. inclusion! Fuck yeah, you guys. Let's do this. And now, the news program that starts your day off right. Good morning, South Park! An attack on the SPPD police station last night has left citizens in shock and disbelief. With prisoners now on the loose and policemen in the hospital, one member of the Chamber of Commerce has had enough and is announcing his bid for mayor. The citizens of South Park deserve to feel safe. Safe from vigilantes who go around farting on people's heads. Together! We can free ourselves from the anal terrorism that has been forced upon us. My name is Mitch Connor, and I endorse this message. 